That's a weird thing with like Australian culture is like we um uh, we put our criminals on like high pedestals and all that. Like like yeah, two of the biggest names of like Australian history are fucking Ned Kelly and, and Chopper, Chopper Reed. Reed. I know exactly. Who <laughs> yeah, you're talking about. Exactly. <laughs> Chopper's a mad cunt too. Ah, uh, rip. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like uh, Chopper Reed was just like a, uh, it was like it a was, gangster it assassin. Was a, it was an assassin dude. sort yeah. of debt collector sort of thing. Yeah, like with who like didn't give a shit about anything. And like, yeah. there's a very good um, uh, movie about Chopper starring um, Heath, Le- and Heath Ledger. Not fucking. Heath Ledger. Uh, fucking what's his name? Uh, he's super famous now in American movies. It's like, I know, uh, I know, I, I know who yeah. you're talking about, but you're not trying to, like, tell me his I'm, name. Yeah, it's because, like, I had his name, then as soon as, like, I was about to say his name, it's, like, fucking gone. Mm. God damn it. It's not Brad Pitt, that is stupid. Shut up, Jack, you yeah. stupid. <laughs> See, this is proof that I don't really give a shit about, um, celebrities and all that. Like, this is, <laughs> this is why that whole, um, um, Denzel Washington thing came from. What? Uh, fucking... It was a huge thing that, like, Marcus and I, like, talked about, I, th- I think, like, a year ago. Uh, I can't remember what film we were watching, but, like, there was just, like, main character was a black dude. Yep. And, like, I was trying to be, like, super funny. He's like, dude, Denzel Washington is such a great actor. He's like, well, yeah, yeah, he is. And I just had <laughs> a stupid look on my face, like... And then Marcus turns to me and goes... You didn't know that that was Denzel Washington, did you? Did you not know that that's Denzel Washington? Like, not a fucking clue. (laughs) (laughs) I was trying to be, like, super, like, hilarious. Funny and sort of, like, racist and shit. Racist, yeah. It's like, all black actors look the same. It's like, I'm a fucking idiot. (laughs) I am so fucking Should have said something like Morgan Freeman. Yeah. Yeah, because that was my first choice, but I'm like, nah, it's totally Denzel Washington. That would be funnier than Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Fuck, I want to kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> That'll haunt me for the rest of my days. <laughs> uh, what is that damn repair kit? Oh, shit. Fuck, it came out of nowhere. Chopper, Chopper Reed was fucking, is fucking cool as shit. Yeah, like, I'm still trying to fucking think of the actor's he's, name. He's like, he's like, he's, he's just like really intelligent. My dad has like a few of his books and shit. Yeah, yeah. And. Oh, Marcus was super into tro- uh, Chopper Reed and all that. Yeah. It's like, he had a uh, uh, documentary about him where it's like, yeah, a bunch of people interviewed him and. Yeah. And stuff. And like. The best bit was like after the credits, they had like a little outtake where, um, where like in the middle of the interview, like Chopper just slowly passes out, he just slowly falls asleep, and then they overlaid like a phone message that they got like later when they packed up. It was like, Oh, I'm fucking sorry about that, mate. I had fucking sleeping pills just before you came, and they just kicked in mid interview. Oh, I'm fucking sorry. <laughs> That's funny, actually. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, like, after he became, like, super famous, got a movie, at a fucking, like, books and shit, he just became an artist, like, a reclusive artist, just... Oh, that's right, he did, yeah. And he also had, like, a weird comedy tour at one point. Did he? Yeah, yeah, fucking, Marcus has a DVD or it's a fucking funny shit. He's like, yeah, he just talked about all the hilarious shit that happened to him in prison. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> like, um... Uh, one day, like, there was this, this one dude who's super fucking annoying. Like, yeah, he's just annoying the shit out of him. And, like, what he did, it's so, like, that day it was his turn to, uh, no, let's do this. It was his turn to, uh, help do, uh, kitchen duty and, like, send out, like, uh, send everyone in the, in, like, his block, like, little bits of jam and yeah, shit. Yeah. So they can have, like, in the middle of the night and all that. And, um... Oh, what are those damn dogs doing? <laughs> so, uh, yep. so, yes, back to the story. So, um, like he hands out uh, everyone's fucking uh, bits of jam, and yep. uh, 
It was at the part of the night where, like, all the lights go out, fucking... Hey! Shut up! Yeah. All the lights go out, everyone has to fucking go to bed, right? Yeah. So, like, um... And what people do is they have the fucking gym just before they go to bed. It's like, little, like, yay, fucking... Yeah. It's like, I might be in prison, at least I have me jam. <laughs> yeah. So, um... Any... And everything's all fucking qu uh, quiet, right? And then you just hear... <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> like, and... Did he shit in it? <laughs> <laughs> Let me finish. Okay. okay. <laughs> like, um, and for some reason, like, um, uh, they're not allowed to point names and shit uh -huh. at uh, people. Like he, like he knew exactly who did this shit to him. So like, uh, guards go like, uh, fucking so and so. What the fuck is going on here? He goes, you know, you fucking. That bloke, right? So, yes, yes. He, 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 he shit me, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> so, so yeah, <laughs> pitch black. He's just eating jam, and then part of fucking chopping shit. <laughs> oh, it's the best. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, he had like a weird um comedy thing going like it, it didn't last long but like it was fucking fascinating it was like and uh his opening act was like some uh fucking Aussie football player who was like kinda known for like also doing kinda shitty things so like <laughs> so uh yeah he was also like part of the tour as like the opening act and shit and like one of my uh, one of his uh, funniest jokes, I think, was like um, he met a whole bunch of like uh, famous people in America or some shit, and like uh, he was getting like a job interview or some shit from them and all that. But before uh, before meeting them, like uh, uh, fucking I think it was like Frank Sinatra or some fucking like famous like jazz singer. Yeah was like performing there and like the and he meets him and he's like uh hey um i know this is a tall ass but uh you just do me a favor i'm fucking uh getting like a job interview or some shit here and uh if you could uh just come to me like mid interview and say oh hey rocco how you doing and like it would like put me up as like a uh, someone they should hire it's like yeah i'm popular with fucking frank sinatra and shit so if like that happens like middle of the fucking interview if like uh, he shows up and goes, Hello, Rocco. How are you? He goes, Fuck off, Frank. I'm busy. <laughs> uh, see, I, I wish I had that fucking DVD. Like, I know Marcus has it, but, like, I need to fucking, like, borrow it from him and fucking show it. Because, like, some really fucking fascinating shit about Chopper in there. Treatsies. It's like, Chopper has like really good morals and shit like that. Yeah, even though he's like a fucking a deadly murdering. assassin yeah. and shit. But like, he was, he was like, because he was like raped as a kid. Oh, yeah. Which and um, he, he went to prison, like some of his cellmates just happened to be like pedophiles and like yeah. rape, rapists, yeah, rapists and, and, shit. and shit like that. So like... He'd fucking torture the fuck out of him. Like, I think he killed a dude in prison by, like, shoving a broom hand, broom, the broom stick hand, yeah, broom 15 handle. inches up his ass. Yeah, so... Apparently that's when it, like, hits your heart. Yeah, it hit the bottom of his heart, uh, bottom of his heart, made it stop, and, yeah, he just died. Yeah. Yeah. And, like, there was another thing that he did. It's like, I can't remember why, but, like, he needed to get out of prison. And, like, the, the best way to do I that wanna is... I want to say, like, I want to say it was a bet. Yeah, I, he yeah. said, "I bet you I could get out of prison tonight." Yeah, and the yeah, guy was and, like, "Yeah, sure, why the fuck not?" And like his idea was like, "Okay, the easiest way to go to uh, get out of prison is if I uh, go to the hospital." Go to the hospital. So what he does is he gets like one of his friends to cut off the skin off his off of his fucking ears. Yeah, yeah. So it's like, yeah, he had to go into like uh, intensive care and shit. And um, apparently, when he, when his friend was like cutting off his ear. Like he was like doing, he was it, doing super it super slow. slow. He's, like, he's like, mate, oh, this is not a fucking operation. <laughs> just fucking tear it off, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> what a mad cunt. Yeah, he's, he's fucking insane, dude. Yeah, I'm sure. 
Like, oh yeah, there's one bit, like, in the movie that, um, that really fucking freaked me out. It's, um, like, one of his friends, like, I can't remember why, but, like, he just starts stabbing Chopper in the gut. He's like, and Chopper's like, that's a fucking weird way to hug people. <laughs> what are you doing? And he just keeps stabbing him over and over again in the gut. And he's like, w w what are you doing? And, and then, like, after, like, 10, 15 seconds, it hits him and goes... He just slowly pulls up his shirt. He's like just bleeding everywhere, and he just, huh? Well, fuck. <laughs> and he just sits down, and like his friend who was stabbing him just like sits down and just starts bawling his eyes out. Like, it's a fucking weird, powerful movie. <laughs> yeah. Pissed all over my leg today. <laughs> I don't know, we're just talking about fucking, like, this really weird fucking, uh, Australian famous murderer and shit. I'm like, oh, piss myself. Well, the cunt's name's King Wee Wee, so I was sort of thinking about piss, and I pissed away from my leg today. How? I don't know, sometimes your cock just decides to be a cock, and, like, I don't know, I just sort of just decided to go, instead of straight into the toilet, just, like, pull it down my leg. Yeah. Like it. uh, it's like when I wake up and it's like I go to pee and I don't check my dick and it's like I start peeing then I realise why is it going in two different directions no shit that's fucking like, worse oh that's right because a pube got in the way <laughs> I hate that <laughs> it's the fucking trials of someone who has a small dick <laughs> a pube get yeah, a pube will get in the way about Eddie yeah. and Richie and shit. <laughs> yeah. It's because Richie has a hell small dick. Is that it there? No, Eddie, that's a pube. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you have a tattoo on your penis? It's Ethel Kaji's phone number. <laughs> well, it was. Since it's so small, all it could fit was no. <laughs> <laughs> No, we're not done here. Okay. <laughs> we got fucking bullshit crystals we have to explode. Lame. Yeah. I don't know where the fuck I am. <laughs> At the beginning. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Man, it sucks that fucking uh, Rick Mail died. I'm still bummed out about yeah, that. Yeah, it's pretty shitty. Yeah. I'm also super bummed out that, like, uh, the recording where, um, like, right after that happened, like, uh, it was, like, me, Marcus, and Adam, and I was the only one who knew fucking Rick Mayer. Uh-huh. So it's like, oh, yeah, I'm super bummed out that he's dead, and, like, Marcus is like, eh, who fucking cares? Like, bruh, what the fuck? Yeah, <laughs> what the fuck, man? You're the guy who's like, oh, we shouldn't, uh, demoralize a person when they die, even if they're, like, a fucking terrible person. And you're like, oh yeah, this great person. Really? Like, yeah. Yeah, like... Fucking, uh... When the leader of the West Barrow uh, Baptist Church died, he's like... We, sh we shouldn't be celebrating that he died. Like, yeah, he's a dick, but a death is a death. Nah. I understand where he's coming from, but nah. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, my, um... Yeah, my rebuttal was like... Like... He may have died, but a dick is a dick. <laughs> yeah. Just, be, yeah. just because a guy died doesn't excuse him for what he did. Ah, what the fuck? Everyone dies. Like... Exactly. You can just shoot it. Much no. quicker. Not with this fucking gun. Actually, yes it is. It, like, gets rid of it one shot. So have you heard anything about um, the Steam controller? Like now that like it's out, is it? Yeah, no, I've, I've not heard yeah, anything. Because like I've been hearing some like amazing shit about it. It's a terrible fucking controller. Who would have thought? <laughs> yeah, everyone's like, "Oh, Steam controller's fucking great!" And like I'm like when it was first revealed, I'm like. This is the dumbest looking fucking it's controller. It's so fucking stupid. It doesn't it's, have fucking thumbsticks or anything. Like it has one, but... Does it? Yeah, it's like where the uh, 
um, fucking D-pad is on the 360 controller. Uh -huh. But, like, it's, yeah, it's so dumb, the fucking buttons are loud as fuck. Like, um, and, like, 90% of the time, like, they don't even, the controller doesn't even fucking work Actually, with the games. That's fucking shit. Yeah. It's fucking shit he has. It is, like, the worst fucking controller ever. I don't even know like, where I was going. Like, yeah, it's, like, it's not the final product. It's just, like, um, people, it's just, like, the, the test of the controller, but still. This is a pretty fucking poor fucking, uh, beta test of a, of hardware. Yeah. God damn. Like, it's so bad, like, people are wondering, like, did they even bother testing it at all? Wow. Yeah. It's like, I don't understand why they, like, even made it. It's like, not, it's not like Steam needs that, like, more money. <laughs> yeah, it's fucking... Well, with, with a, like, when you, um, a company, like, you can't just do, like, the one thing. You need to, like, expand a bit more. So, like, I understand yeah, yes. where they're going with that, but... Like, fuck me. Oh, hey. You got an achievement. Yay. <laughs> yeah, it's I something I, I totally care, care. I care a lot about that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you got, like, a corrosive artifact. So, like, your... Uh, when you uh, go to your, um... Uh, backpack next, you'll see it, there's like a uh, orange thing, so yeah. yeah, you use that and your punches will do like... But I think my punches damage. now set people on fire, so... I'm yeah, you can set people on fire and also explode people, so yeah, you got that too. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what to next? What we got, what we got, what we got? Oh yeah, we got... Uh, we got shit. Eh, fuck it. We'll do this bit next time anyway. Okay. Yeah. Well, this, this, is, yeah, this, this is actually pretty good. Yeah, yeah. It, it feels good to, like, start recording again after, you know, months of not yeah. doing it. Like, even if it is a game that we don't really care for that much. Yeah. yeah. Let's hope this one doesn't fucking break. <laughs> fuck. Famous last words. Yeah. Fuck. Well, if it breaks, at least get it to a point that I can actually fucking fix it. Yeah. <laughs>